Hello everybody, Evelina here. It's day 17 of Authentic Transformation and in today's video I would like to talk to you about wellness and what can you learn from a vegan. If you pay attention and notice your body, you probably know that feeling well, relaxed and vibrant, it's your normal state of being and anything different than that it's a sign that there is possibly some disbalance happening in your body so you have to pay attention to it as Jim Rohn says if you don't look after your body where are you gonna live a lot of my friends and family um, have been um, making good comments about my energy levels and, and about how vibrant I am and sometimes I would also hear them complaining about that they are feeling tired even when they wake up in the morning or they're just overall not feeling too well. So the first question I normally would ask them is, what did you eat today? And once I, I hear what they've eaten, I immediately um, know that their body maybe have spent a lot of time digesting the food because it wasn't so good for them instead of actually using the energy to do more productive stuff. So that inspired me to do the video today, which I would like to give you four simple things that you can do in your life to improve um, your energy levels. And by simply doing this, you might also get inspired to try maybe going vegan for breakfast or vegan for lunch or vegan for dinner. So the first tip that I would like to give you is to replace the animal milk, which is the cow's milk, with any plant-based milk. You probably know that we're the only species on earth that consumes milk that doesn't come from our own species. And never mind that, after the age of three, consuming any milk, it's completely unnecessary. So if you really still want to have a glass of milk, glass of milk of some form or right or maybe like it in your coffee or in your cereal or any on any shape or form I encourage you to try all the different plant-based milks that are in the supermarket or, or in a health food store and choose a favorite one I have tried all of them and once you try all of them you will definitely have a favorite one almond is absolutely wonderful in a smoothie you can also uh, replace the hazelnut milk for example if you, if you like drinking chai or tea and coffee with hazelnut milk it's also very nice so i encourage you to try all the plant-based milks and you can also do that even as a cold drink as well it's really really nice the second thing i encourage you to do is to change your salad dressing. Now instead of using uh, mayonnaise or anything that obviously comes from, a, um, from an animal, you can replace it with very simple salad dressings. Under this video um, I will share with you three of my most favorite salad dressings which I use nearly every day and which are really really give richness and goodness to the salad. My third tip is uh, whenever you cook vegetables, please consume the water. The water where the vegetables have been is the most nutritious part when, you cook, when, when, when it comes to eating cooked vegetables. It doesn't matter what vegetable that is, uh, cabbage, carrots, any vegetables that you cook, broccoli, please keep the, uh, keep the water and use it in some way. Maybe you can make a soup or you can make a stew or you can make curry or anything at all use that water that's where all the minerals are and my other tip which is also very easy is choose your favorite di dishes that are unfortunately coming with meat but you can replace the meat with a bean lentil or some other vegetable that you like and by doing that you will actually start to feel a lot better in yourself you will possibly not experience bloating or heaviness anymore and you will naturally have more energy. So I encourage you to do that and I would love to hear your comments and please subscribe to my, to my channel as well. Thank you very much for watching my video today and I'll talk with you tomorrow. Bye for now.